Bosch has had a subpar game to this point, Steve. Well, his game is rebounding, Marvin. It's almost as if he's shying away from contact here tonight. He's got to be way more aggressive here in the fourth quarter. Blair looking for the ball. Delivery to Leonard. Grant by Wade. Chalmers to the front court. The ball is loose. Duncan for the block shot. Our Duncan's shot blocking presence really allows the Spurs perimeter players to stay at home on shooters. Look out, looks like he's going to try and break his man down. Pass to Duncan. And Manu Ginobili with 14 points. Boy, that was great execution on that set right there, Marvin. They've been doing it all night. That's how they've built this lead. Really, really sound offense. Offensive foul on Bosch. San Antonio's bench has been a major factor. Oh, that's right, Marv. This reserve unit has really stepped up and played well tonight. You see from some of these replays, the moves they've been able to make going to the basket, scoring, knocking down shots, really giving their team a boost tonight. Blair gets it back to him. The pass to Ginobili. And rebounded by Haslam. Wade walks it across. And it's a backcourt violation. Well, Steve, they give it right back. What an inopportune time to get sloppy. Yeah, in the fourth quarter, our coaches just want to get down and get shots to the basket each time. Some kind of offensive rhythm, some kind of flow, because otherwise you lose all your momentum. Duncan hands it off. And Mario Chalmers called for the foul. That's his first. This is a critical juncture in this game. This club starting to lose its grip on the game itself, and I think they might want to get a timeout here. And LeBron James with the bucket, and what a pretty look. Delivery to Ginobili. Duncan is turned back. to Haslam. Yes. Defensively, Mark, I like the effort. They're contesting shots. They're getting in people's faces. Those shots can't go in all night. Chalmers trying to stay in front of him. He shoots from three-point territory. Beautiful shot. Mark, I think they've done a nice job tonight offensively running their sets. They look very effective. They're finding the open shooter. They've developed a good groove here tonight. James trying to break free. Snatched by Jackson. Another terrific defensive effort there, and it has been that kind of an evening. That's how they've built this lead, Mark. Duncan trying to break free. Handled by Haslam. 
Well, I'm not sure about that shot, Lord. You've got the lead, and it's early in the shot clock. You really want to make the defense work in this situation. James, again, rebound by Genova. This is how they've built this lead, Mark. Tough defense every time down the floor. Duncan trying to free himself up. The pass to Ginobili. Controlled by Haslam. It's the screen. Delivery to Bosch. Fires. And Chris Bosch off target. Minute and a half remaining in the fourth. Miami down by nine. Looking at the post area. Haslam rebound. Wow, what a defensive possession. And Mark, this is how this team's going to get back into the ballgame. Fourth three. And Dwayne Wade not able to hit. Oh, a flamboyant finish. It's a big play there, Mark. The second chance opportunity. When you're down, any type of effort play, hustle play like that one can get you back into the ballgame. Pass to Jackson. And rebounded by Bosch. Miami looking to talk it over. Well, this is desperation time, Mark. Facing this kind of deficit, you've got to get a quick three. So I would look for maybe a flare screen or maybe a pick and pop. Get a shooter open, knock down a three, and then... Try to set up your defense, force a turnover, or maybe foul. And even then, you're probably in trouble, but you never know. The Alamo pass. And Chris Bosch able to finish it. Chalmers digging in defensively. The pass to Ginobili. And Udonis has one call for the foul. That is number four. All right, let's take a look at tonight's performer of the game highlights. Yeah, he's the player of the game. I agree, Marv. He's been fantastic tonight. The defense has been basically helpless, you see, in some of these replays. They're trying to challenge shots, but he's just rising up and scoring at will. That's why he's the player of the game. That's why his team is probably going to win tonight. Hits on both, and this game may be out of reach. Seven-point lead. Miami takes a timeout. Well, at this point, Marv, you've got to put your best shooters on the floor. Facing this kind of deficit, probably need threes. So look for this club to draw something up to get a perimeter look. And then at that point, force a turnover. If you can't do that, you've got to foul. Hope that the other team misses, because this is really desperation time. wants to stop the clock. Well, Mark, facing this kind of deficit, you're really in big trouble, but what you try to do is get a quick three-pointer off. So maybe a flare screen or a quick pick and pop. Try to get a shooter open, knock down a three, and then you've got to force a turnover. If not, foul and send somebody to the line. But either way, they're probably in trouble at this point. Who's there? 
Choice here, they had to stop the clock so they give the foul. He hits on both, and this game may be out of reach. Seven point lead. Delivery to Wade, down to 30 seconds to go in the fourth. Miami down by seven. Oh, that's a foul to stop the clock, and he'll go to the line. And Dwight Blair to the line. James. One second differential between the game clock and the shot clock. He steps back for three. Strong to the cut. Blair able to reach for it. Pass to Ginobili. performance tonight. I would think they would like to file this game somewhere and forget about it. The Heat have come up short. The final score is 50 to 42. Marv Albert along with Steve Kerr saying good night from American Airlines Arena. We head to the fourth quarter. Steve, as you know, you've been there before. This game is still within reach. Well, anytime you have a, a comfortable lead and you're at home, Mark, it's important to try to close things out. And you do that with defense. You don't want to trade buckets here. You've got to make stops and really continue to build this lead. And Dwayne Wade at the line. 